Hey everybody, it's DJ here, and welcome back to Call of Duty Black Ops 2. Last time we played, we ended up playing Solarium. It was the second mission. Trying to uncover some stuff about Menendez. How much wealth he built over the years. And um, whatever he's using, Solarium is the key. And before Eric was shot through his throat, or just, yeah, he was basically shot through the neck. He was talking about like how there was something going on in the lab, talking about something called Karma, supposedly the name for the cyber weapon. But yeah, we're about to go into old wounds back in Afghanistan, 1986. So let's go see what intel we can gather. I can't figure out Menendez without getting inside his fucking head. Salazar, you grew up in Nicaragua during his rise to power. You know his legends better than anyone. Tell me, why does he hate us so much? Tu primera guerra fría. As a boy, he witnessed the country's rape and murder his people. In 1972, there was a colossal earthquake. His family lost everything. A year later, the only thing he ever loved, his sister Josefina, was crippled in a fire. Raul and his father started over, sold drugs for easy money. They became rich, powerful legends of Managua. The Menendez cartel was all but untouchable, so the CIA took out Raul's father in a U.S. sanctioned assassination. Right, so now Menendez fucking hated America and started running guns in Afghanistan for his own private army. The CIA got wind of it, went on the hunt for him in Kabul. That was the photo Wood showed us in the vault, remember? See that handsome bastard? That's me. The only one's your father. After Nam. The numbers and all that? And he was one dangerous son of a bitch. <laughs> yep, Mason was nothing but dangerous. Old wounds, Afghanistan. Here we are. It's showtime, Mason! What'd you see, Woods? Sand. Sand and more fucking sand. Hudson's contact's on his way. You reckon we can trust the Chinese? We can't hear. They've been supporting the Mujahideen, same as us. They know if Russian was in Afghanistan, they'd be looking at China next. No one likes the Russians, huh? You know me. I don't like anyone. You never did, Wood. You get your head down. Take it easy, Sal. Deliver the weapons. I mean, we come in peace. Now, what about your end of the deal? I will take you to the leader of the Mujahideen. He can help you find Raul Menendez. We have fresh horses. You will follow. All right. Shit. Let's do it. And little does Zhao know, he's hey, going to be hey, dead later on in the game. We're on our way to the Mujahideen camp now. Going to access this. What the hell are you going to do with that? You never know. Right, I mean, this thing may be old, but it's still sharp. Can cut some heads clean off with this. I'm sure I don't need to remind you that our presence here must remain 100% deniable. Let's go. There will be serious consequences if Russia learns of our involvement in Afghanistan. The only way they'll find out is they take us down. Yo, that ain't gonna happen. I know that ain't gonna happen. I'm straight, I'm straight up riding on a horse, thinking about the Lone Ranger. Yeah! This the village y'all was talking about? I guess so. Yeah. 
And this does kind of give me a little bit of, what was it? A little bit of Indiana this Jones way. vibes. When they were in that village and he shot that guy with the sword. Even though Raiders of the Lost Ark came out in the 81. And of course, this is a little flashback in 86. If a Russian attack is indeed imminent, you're going to need all the help you can get. I've arranged for a couple of specialists to act in an advisory capacity. Here they are now. Ramon, this is Woods and Mason, my two best men. We need weapons, not soldiers. For real? This should be good. Yeah, it should be. Hey, look here, Ramon. You're going to need all the help you can get. Just so we're so, clear. We Be grateful, bro. Attack. You give us what you have on Menendez. Our base is here. Any advance will come through one of the narrow passes leading into the valley. I know this. Our men defend these mountains. Our weapons will give them an edge. That's a bullshit plan. They're talking about the Russian army here. They come at you a brute force, which means strength in numbers and heavy armor. Are your men ready for that? They have no experience with the weaponry we brought. We do. We belong in the front line. They ain't got no experience. Well, they're gonna learn today. You have faith in your plans, America. I got more than faith, Zhao. Let's rock it. Let's go. But first, let me grab a little piece of intel and uh, grab some motors. We must hurry. We cannot allow them to enter the valley. Settle up, Mason. All right, I'm on it, Woods. Let's go. Yeah. Follow him. This might be tougher than we thought. We got hips dropping infantry right in front of the camp. Straight up doing a horse buy. Dang, I missed the chopper. But it's all good. There's more things for me to blow up. Anyway, we're for we're for real on a horse with an AK doing horse buys. Or in this case, ride buys. Used to be down with the AK. Now we're at this little spot. Too fucking close. Follow me. Gotta go through these little ruins. And shoot and slice off some Russian heads. We got a free TR. Push it through the ruins. There goes our arm. And another one. We cannot let it enter the valley. Another BTR yeah, is no. this way. There's a guy right here. Oh. <laughs> Dang. The bullet didn't reach his brain until it was too late. It took him a minute to feel that. Fill your ammo. Get this RPG. Open up this crate. Also, I'm not probably the only one to notice this, but if you like. Got one tank. Goes the other one. Alright, we're good. Ooh, I'm a little. I'm a little pinned down. All right, let's go. Okay, good guy. Anyway, yeah, in the first mission, if you listen closely, Menendez br brings up ramen, which means ramen. I mean, of course, he already knew about us, and he knew what to do. But yeah, he said, Mulala, ramen. Do not concern yourself with local politics. Hudson, the west choke point is secure. Armor ain't getting through this way. Woods, Mason, they're throwing everything they have. I never like paid attention to that for real. Who's 
Cruiser reporting rushing tanks moving in from the north. Roots force and strength in numbers. We expected such a fight. Hold on, let me. Let me place one of these mines. Come on, dismount. Oh, bad spot right here. Up. Oh, dang, I missed it. I was trying to place it in the middle of the road. I screwed that up. Right here. Okay, move, 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 move. Oh, there we go. Now we can destroy this other one. Where do you think you're going? <laughs> We're seeing enemy Elos approaching from the east. Move to Got that taken care of. We got a chopper. And down it goes. Oh, got it. Russian gunships are down. We have more Russian Elos inbound from the north. That little lock on helped nicely. Oh, got another one. Turn around. And comment down below y'all favorite level of this game. Your favorite little mission. Lock on required. The Russian defenses are weak. The base is under threat. Got it that time. The gunships are neutralized. The Russians have overrun the Mush ammo cache in the east. Do whatever is necessary to recapture it. Mula Roman is concerned. He thinks we're losing the fight. You tell Rana for me, I'll give a shit about his concerns. We'll kick fucking ass, same as always. The ammo cast is yep, left we'll of the do it our way, the one way or another. By horse. Shoot. The path is impassable by horse. Dismount. We will proceed on foot. Gotcha. Okay, we gotta go up there and reclaim that cash. Infantry, fast roping in. Ooh. Don't let their feet touch the Did him dirty. <laughs> I got somebody that was coming down the rope. Got caught in the fire. Oh, we got one guy in here. And and this, these guys are straight spawning in this room. What the heck? Okay, good guy. Okay, the ammo stuff is ours. It should be. Hudson, the ammo cache is ours. You fight bravely, American. Mason, return to base. Yep, that's how we do. That's how we do, Tenzel. We got a little problem at base. And now the other problem is I died again. Okay, what other problem we got at base? I'm saying we got multiple problems out out here where I am. I'm saying I'm getting shot at. I got to deal with a whole bunch of bullet wounds and scratches. What other problem is there, Hudson? Your old man was one tough son of a bitch. Bet your ass he was. Kravchenko basically carved a hole in his head and he shoved those fucking numbers in there and he survived that. No. They just they didn't see those numbers anymore, but I don't know. I'm not so sure about that. Of course. Because... The numbers are about to show up again. This isn't over yet. Oh, man. The Russian army do not play. The Russians want to give us one last display of brute force. Let's give them one last display of courage. You with me? Yeah! Give me KA, motherfucker. <laughs> Let's go. Ba -da -da, da -da 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 -da. 
Okay, we're losing a lot of guys. Ah, oh, man, a horse. You're a good horse. I'm sorry this had to happen to you. Roll over. Woods. <laughs> Freaking crap, Jenko. Of course, he's involved in all this. This is for Reznov. And the thing about this part is, it's hella hard to like resist shooting him. the room. Next thing you know, he's talking to the Russian. Fucking Reznov. Good old Tricky Vic. Woods. Ooh, Maybe tricky I should Vic. handle this interrogation. Either you stay the fuck out of my way. I can unfinish the business with this bastard. I left you to rot in Vietnam, Sergeant Woods. You should be dead. Well, nobody told me. Well, you should have known Robin he was going to come back, Kranchenko. Nicaraguan. Then Raul Menendez. What do you do for him? Never in your life you spin in American's right? face. Huh? This is a Mujahideen, baby. Because you mess around and they get smoked. Mess around and get smoked, boy. I'll take you out quick. Oh, resist. Resist. Tell me about my name. Resist. I suit him once. Boy, that X button. That it's hard to resist. Come on, 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 come on. Oh my god. <laughs> I accidentally pressed the pause button. Where are the weapons go? Cuba. Be ready, be ready. The third world. Why? I'm pressing everything. I'm pressing every friggin' thing. I'm finna mess this up. That's not gonna happen. Oh, oh I did it. More powerful than you know. He even has people in the CIA. Bullshit! <laughs> this guy's fucking with us. Actually, he wasn't. The fuck are you doing? Menendez told me you must suffer. You face piece of shit. Ramen. You damn rat. No, you are and always will be our true enemy. And there you go with that spitting shit again. Without water and shelter, you may last a day. If you are strong. Believe it or not, ramen noodles, we're strong as hell. Just gonna leave us in the desert and drive off. I mean, that's how the Mujahideen will do. Bury you in the sand, peel your eyelids back, all that. Just like Wood said earlier. So, man, I, I thought I wasn't gonna be able to resist. Just like your old man. No, it wasn't him. That's not. Come on, if you think it was him, don't you think he would have stuck around for a bit, huh? Maybe explain some shit? 
Good old Tricky Vic. Man. I remember when I played Black Ops for the first time, I did not see that coming when Mason was basically hallucinating the entire time. Razanov wasn't even there. Like at all. It was crazy. With those numbers and Reznov being stuck in his head. Alright. And then we have a little strike force mission. But we're going to do that in the next look. We're going to do that next time. When we do some more Black Ops 2. If y'all enjoyed, be sure to hit that like button. Click subscribe. And also hit the bell. Because I upload gameplays daily. And you don't want to miss any of them. And I will see y'all next time. I still can't believe I managed to resist. I I was like hella nervous. I mean, I'm pressing everything. I'm accidentally pressing the Xbox home button and all of that. Peace.